Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Just Code It with Sarsar. In this channel, we discuss about tech, career, part, uh, product and life. So with this, we are starting with the part 2 of the video uh, with ET, uh, about software engineering, uh, engineering journey at Twitter. If you have not yet watched part 1, I will put the link here in somewhere in the uh, above. You can check that out first uh, to get to know more about that. And in this particular part, we will discuss about her life experiences along with what is the life at Twitter, what are the different perks at Twitter, how she was able to manage her life, what are the different perks that, uh, that one can get at Twitter and how she is liking her work at Twitter, what, what the day-to-day -day work looks like and how, how you can move and transition from, from uh, your current role towards Twitter. So stay tuned till the end of this video to get to know more about it, how she was practicing, what was her success mantra, what are the resources she used and uh, how she was able to crack Twitter. So moving on to the happy parts of it, like after joining Twitter, how is the work culture there? How has been things going on? Like, uh, How would you explain work-life balance and everything at Twitter? So uh, to be honest, I've never seen such warm, welcoming people anywhere else. Mm -hmm. uh, people are so good and you can like, uh, I've been here for just three months and it doesn't feel that way. Uh, they are so welcoming that it was very easy to blend in. So, uh, so there is an incident. Uh, I like got the chance to talk to manager of my manager. And mm -hmm. the first thing he told me, uh, don't just be here to code because you'll have to code your entire life. You are, right. you are a software engineer and you'll code because that's the part of your job. Mm -hmm. But go interact with people. There are people with so many different countries, backgrounds, and sub mm -hmm. itni talented. You'll learn a lot. So go blend in communities, join Karo. And okay. may, you might like that their staff and you want to move and move to that team and work there. So mm -hmm. just don't be here to code. So I think the best advice thing was to learn more. Zyada, uh, seekho ke zyada baat karo ke might be of your use, might be related mm -hmm. to your project, might not be related to your project. But mm -hmm. horizons jab expand hota hai, when you talk to different people, I think wo different learning hai, jo kahi aur nahi mil paegi. And people okay. are open for it. They are mm -hmm. supporting it. Like he, they're happy if you're asking them something else or you're discussing some new technologies. And I would say like I joined here as a fresher, but her cheez mein, they ask your opinion. They ask Correct. like, do you want to go for be it tech start or be it how do you want to approach this problem? How do you want mm -hmm. to put it forward? So, some uh, they there is a chance that they will reject or they will accept your proposals depending on how many counter reasoning they have. But if mm -hmm. you have something just like a strong foundation and you feel that this should and you have a strong point supporting it, and then mm -hmm. they are willing to accept it. They are not like you are a fresher. You don't have experience. Nahi hai. Uh, uh, we are telling you na, that's how it happens. It is not like that. They are very open. Right. They are open for everything. And they are mm -hmm. open to talk, have meetings. And in fact, uh, uh, since there is a time gap, like half of the team sits there, but still they are ready to keep meetings such a way, like keep it alternative so that it is evening for me or maybe morning for them or sometimes morning for me and evening for them so that nobody has to suffer. Everybody is able to interact with everyone. So that way they are very flexible, I would say, and very good. Mm -hmm. And talking about a work-life balance, so I don't think you can get work-life balance better than Twitter because uh, they actually tell you like, go on, uh, they provide you with so much fun and mm -hmm. they tell you go to the shopping spree, enjoy your life and right. then go, come back, sit and then go enjoy, take holidays. So Seriously. that way, uh, very, very good actually. Right. So, Coffee yeah. awesome story. I think uh, uh, the best part is ki, uh, there is one thing you are going out and reaching out to people and trying it on your behalf but this is something when if upper management ki side, se aa hai ki you should try and track more. So, it has a level impact. Hota hai. And that sets the company ki policy care towards employees, uh, employees and their work uh, and their culture, their growth. So, it was a good thing for me. Work-life balance is good at a lot of companies. Uh, but like this sets a new benchmark. Ki 
आफ्टर वर्क लाइफ बैलेंस दे आर आल्सो रेकमेंडिंग कि अपने लोगों से रीच आउट करो उनसे बात करो इंटरेक्ट मोर हैव फन हैव शॉपिंग लाइक आर लाइक डू समथिंग एक्साइटिंग एग्जैक्टली एग्जैक्टली इंटर उन्होंने इंटरनली इतनी कम्युनिटीज बनाई हुई है सो दैट वेयर एवर यू फील कंफर्टेबल लाइक एवरीबॉडी इज नॉट कंफर्टेबल विद एवरीथिंग सो दे हैव स्मॉल स्मॉल बट डिफरेंट डिफरेंट मल्टीपल कम्युनिटीज फॉर एवरीथिंग एंड दे आर लाइक एंड दे आर वेरी वेलकमिंग इट्स नॉट लाइक कि uh they are sitting in us so they'll just uh, plan things according to their stuff but wo sab ki timelines ke according cheeze karte hain so it's very easy and convenient jab kisi bhi community ko jaake join kar lo and then uh-huh. they talk to you like as if they are your friends and peers or sab same level par uh-huh. hai so i think that way twitter has amazing work culture okay theek hai i think make sense uh... So with this, we are in the kind of a last leg of our question is. So what I would like to ask is, like, what's your uh, strategy or what's your preparation method for software interview interviews? How do you prepare generally for any uh, interviews that come up? Yeah. So uh, basically, um, first of all, I would say that uh, after data structures and algorithms, you should have like strong foundation, and for that, I think lead code interview bit. अच्छे प्लेटफॉर्म्स हैं एंड देन यू कैन मूव टू कोर्ट शेफ एंड कोर्ट फोर्सेस बट आई वुड से डोंट डायरेक्टली गो देयर बिकॉज देन वो थोड़ा सा कॉन्फिडेंस डाउन हो जाता है इफ यू आर नॉट एबल टू सॉल्व प्रॉब्लम्स देयर सो व्हाट आई जो मैंने अप्लाई किया सो आई स्टार्टेड विद लीड कोर्ट आई सॉल्व मल्टीपल क्वेश्चंस मीडियम लेवल हार्ड लेवल एंड देन आई मूव टू कोर्ट शेफ जस्ट टू सी की वेयर आई स्टैंड एंड देन देयर इज अ सेक्शन वेयर यू कैन लाइक गिव मॉक uh interviews and test so mm-hmm. waha thoda time to hota hai because then you know ki one hour mein you need to solve two three questions and then uh lead code con- contest i would say that's a good way to prepare because in one hour you have like four questions and you are timing ki aap kitni der mein kitne questions kar sakte because these days i think online round is much more difficult than the interviews you face because interviews yeah. mein wo fir bhi thoda medium kind of questions puchta hai but online round mein more of like hard side so mm-hmm. you should know how to like approach those questions and do it in 60 minutes so yeah lead code was like my go to platform where i usually perform and whenever i'm preparing for interviews i like just like select that company and see what kind of questions they ask and that's right. how i usually prepare in fact for twitter as well uh, i went to lead code only and and so the previous questions how they are asking what they generally expectations because people write stuff like what they expect and uh, mm-hmm. what they want to see in your code so it's actually a great insight and you know exactly what to do so yeah correct and i think aaj ke time pe to lead code has become that holy bible or one stop solution for every platform every coding <laughs> yeah. interview you can get to know experiences you have a lot of questions to practice and then there are different approaches and different solution for every question as well ki ye optimized approach hai ye unoptimized approach hai then it's very well explained as well to kafi exciting hai i think uh, makes sense but apart from that uh, were there any other resources that you referred were there anything else that you recommend like any youtube channel or anything that you very really, really like uh, maybe a book or something uh so actually uh, i'm not really good with coding books so i didn't <laughs> use any coding books because uh, i feel ki sirf padhne se you don't get how to code you mm-hmm. actually have to code and jab tak multiple test cases fails likha nahi aata you don't just don't get the feel ki okay what you have to do you need to see that tle and you need to say, uh. see that run time errors otherwise uh, you'll not learn how to code So yeah, there are uh, YouTube channels I used to like. If there was any question I was stuck with, so I usually go to discussion section or the mm-hmm. searching that question on YouTube, and then there are n number of YouTube channels you can see. Not mm-hmm. any specific, but just mm-hmm. the questions and whichever uh, I used to find good piece. Me, thoda descriptive way, man. I'll find something and I'll there. Kuch to take away hoga, kuch aage approaches ke liye. So Correct. that was the thing, but yeah, I think YouTube channels and uh, videos, and especially the discussion section of Lead Code, is the mm-hmm. best material for preparing for your interviews. Right, makes sense. So 
uh, 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 resources are available in like infinitely uh, large quantity. You have to decide on shortlist which works best for you. Maybe somebody can say that books are good. For me, books doesn't work. Okay, I think practical learning is more important than theoretical learning. Uh, but yeah, there are other platforms as well. There are lead code, obviously. Then you have practicing code force and everything. You can read articles at Geek for Geeks and other places. So yeah, a mixed bag of resources there. Cool. Uh, I think uh, finally we are here to wrap it up with all those things. But if you have any recommendations, if you have anything last words to say, if somebody's apply, like looking to apply Twitter, what should they definitely keep in mind for their interview process? Uh, what should they look out for during their interview process? If you have to say something on that. Uh, yeah, so I would be happy if uh, a lot of people suddenly start applying Twitter. Mm -hmm. So first thing, first, uh, don't feel underconfident that uh, Twitter is a, I know Twitter is a big name, but at least go apply because till the time you don't uh, put yourself there field mein ho, you won't see ki aap kitne capable ho, and even rejections are good so mm -hmm. first thing is ki don't be underconfident go for it apply if you find a suitable job reach out mm -hmm. to people they are willing to give you referrals and they will be happy to give you referrals because uh, i don't know how many people know but there are internal referral parties and mm -hmm. we actually employ enjoy that so and then uh, for questions i would say uh, prepare something in the range of medium to hard set of questions uh, wherever mm -hmm. from wherever you feel comfortable but your mm -hmm. questions should range from medium to hard because they i have never seen them asking easy questions if your day is like your stars are superbly working <laughs> then they might but generally they don't they'll be ranging it from medium to hard and one question would be like medium and then other would be hard something like that <laughs> that's the basic combination and then uh, work on your code modularity work how you are writing your code the <laughs> way you're presenting it the small small stuff variable names even they matter because what you are how you are naming your function it does matter because uh, other person who is reading the code usko pata chalna chahiye ki aap likh kya rahe ho because aap apne liye nahi likh rahe ho aapka code finally kisi repo mein uh, ja ke merge hone wala hai so mm -hmm. they check it that and then okay. how much uh, is it scalable or not and then they actually prefer aap agar apne hi code ke test cases bata rahe ho because i remember writing test cases for my code uh, mm -hmm. wo aap ek algorithm batate ho and then they ask you like how will you test your code so it, Better ki aapko pata ho ki kitne edge cases aapko cover karna you need to cover all the edge cases corner cases where mm -hmm. will it fail where will it not so you will have to like comment those out so mm -hmm. make sure you know how to write test cases so that's okay. the one thing and then overall um, they might or they might not ask you about computer fundamental that totally depends on the interviewer but generally they do generally mm -hmm. they do ask about uh, dbms and OS. So make sure you know those stuff, like you know what is threading, what is process, how will mm -hmm. you schedule a process. So you know all these algorithms. So make okay. sure you, uh, so they ask you something. So I say blank now. You like position your know, big discussion, how will mm -hmm. you schedule something like that? So yeah, uh, that would be my suggestion. Yeah, I think a very good advice there. Ki you should be very, uh, very well, uh, uh, like aware of the strong fundamentals and strong foundations. So after DSL go down, it's easy. Hojai. And try to prepare for medium to hard easy. Aage, so it's easily solvable. You have, will have the good day. Yeah. But medium to hard prepare can never best. Rahega. And companies nowadays are more focusing towards how you approach the solution. Kitna scale can make a very much. How much structured way you have answer. Likhe, because uh, at any other good company, there will be a person who is writing the code. Then there will be a set of reviewers who will review the code. And at any other day, like a one year or two year later, other person will totally work on your code to improve it or like many make a big fix or uh, add an extender or feature there. So it's good that you write a code that is readable by a lot of audience. Uh, okay, you have spaghetti code, you have personal projects, so that, that is one way, but interviews may generally make sense that you have such a code. Likhe. And also very good advice ki aap uske edge cases soch le, because if you know about the edge cases as well, that makes a strong impression to the interviewers that you have holistic way soch le about the problem. You know about the test cases, how to write those test cases and everything. So I think that covers all the points. And 
uh i think uh, a lot of you guys will be applying for twitter uh, well, all the best to all the folks who are looking to join twitter uh, as mentioned by it is going to be the best form that you can be there are referral parties there there are a lot of things happening and it's holiday season uh, at twitter so uh, it's it is like almost a chill day there uh so going forward i think uh, that's the end of the session thank you so much ati for sharing your experiences your life journey I, it's been super helpful for me as well uh i have learned a lot about twitter and uh, i am going to love it more day in day out uh, i have been using it constantly and uh, would love to see more of the things that are coming in plan for future in future days so best of luck to you best wishes for you for your future endeavors and thank you uh, uh all the folks who are joining in i will put the linkedin link for it is profile in the description box below you can check that out and connect with her and see you in the next video thank you guys bye bye thank you bye bye thank you So folks with this we come to the end of part 2 of this video i hope you really enjoyed this video with uh, iti uh, we deep dive into a lot of things at uh, twitter and i hope aapko ye video kafi kafi zyada acha laga hoga agar if your friends are inspiring developers and want to crack companies like twitter please share this video with all of your friends and like kar do yaar like karne mein kya jata hai like button thok do and i think uh, uh, if you subscribe to my channel you will get to know more about these uh, amazing companies i am trying very hard to bring guests from different different areas industries and areas so uh, right now we are focusing on software developers they soon we will be focusing on other fields as well uh, we will be having some ux designers business analysts some uh, consultants from different top companies and they will be explaining their life journey and how you can explore different parts and different career life choices and how it can be very very life changing moment for you so stay tuned till the uh, subscribe to my channel for getting such videos amazing videos and see you in the next video bye bye so guys uh, what is newton school newton school ek edtech startup hai jahan pe uh, you can learn more about uh, different technologies out there uh, they will help you get job offer from these top tech companies एंड उनका एक बहुत ही अच्छा प्रोग्राम है जहाँ पे आपको एक रुपया भी पे नहीं करना है जब तक आपके इन कंपनीज में जॉब नहीं लग जाता दे हैव वेरी गुड ऑफरिंग्स विद दिस कोर्स लाइव क्लासेस इंडस्ट्रियल प्रोजेक्ट्स मॉक इंटरव्यूज एंड पर्सनल मेंटरिंग आई वुड पुट द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन एंड आई सजेस्ट यू ऑल टू चेक दिस आउट एंड एक्सप्लोर दिस